Chris Bye. Diamond, <laughs> and that is the flush. Well, that's adding okay. Cheers, Chris. Yeah. insult to injury. Cheers, Chris. Nice to he hit him out of the park like a baseball at the wrong end of a Louisville slugger. And it is back to <coughs> Dallas with no money and a bad experience for Chris Hammond. Huge flush for Rumit Samoya. Only this low straight flush would have been better. He didn't need it. Frankly, he didn't even need the flush. He was way ahead, wasn't he, Michael? Well, he won it on the straight. He, didn't give, he had the three and uh, he made the five uh, with the straight. So he could have won it with the straight. And as it is, he won it with the, uh, the flush. So there you go. He had a straight, he had a flush, he had high cards. All he had for Chris Haman, I'm afraid, was bad news. The American put up a doughty struggle. Didn't perhaps get as many pretty cards as some other players. Well, there we go. 20 hands won by Rumit, 12 by Hardy. That's why they've got the cash. They've been aggressive. They've brought home the bacon when it counted. Here we go again. What have we got this time? Mm. Yeah, it's him to act. Raised all him. He's seen an ace. He doesn't care about the kicker. It's only a four. And he is all in. 3,800 total. For 3,800. 3,800 total. I'll go all in. All in. Oh, wow. He's gone all in as well. There you go. Well, Haygood's called all in, and he is all in all front. In Huge leader. Yep. Only one live card for Chris Parks at the moment. That's the four. Anthony Hardy has got a queen yeah, two. He doesn't need to get involved in no, this, does he? He's, he's not going to get involved. He knows yeah, at least one of them's got an ace. He's not going to get involved at all. He's going to fold. He's just doing his... The Prince of Pantomime. He's doing his little... Uh, that's Pass. it. That's Good it. boy. Yep. Okay. So, two players. Okay, three, eight. Five cards to come. And whoever wins is going to get a second chance at life in this cash game. Yeah, I feel sorry yeah. for Chris. He really hasn't had the cards. And, you know, he's got his ace four. He makes the right move to go all over. He comes up against ace six. Split pot. Yeah, split pot. Is, uh, it's probably the right call. Well, we're going to need to see some high cards for that to happen. Unless one of them hits a four or a six, it's probably the most likely thing. Well... Nine, three. Michael's still in front at the moment, but two cards to come. Chris is hoping for two high cards here. That's one three. of them. That is one of them, but at the moment, the six is still playing. He's got a lot of outs here, Chris. He could hit a diamond as well. He's, uh, I think he's the favourite. Jeez. Yep, there he you go. has hit the diamond. Wow. And there was a little invocation to an unkind god from Michael Haygood. And you can't really blame him. No. That's tough. Because yeah. at the worst, you would have thought he was uh, split potting there. Yeah. Four diamonds on the board. And I'm afraid it's not looking good for our last remaining American. Let's look at the hand comparison. It, Parks was way behind to start with, yeah, with the no, ace I, four I, off. I, I had the queen deuce of hey, good, ace six, well ahead. Then look yeah. at that. Diamonds came queen down, and there was well, another well, diamond well, on the well, river. I hit a lower flush. Here's a four flush. I have a two flush. Yeah, two flush. <laughs> Tony got caught out there because he said he had the queen two of diamonds and someone said no the queen of diamonds was on the on the turn and he went oh maybe it was the queen of arts then yeah queen of arts yeah <laughs> <laughs> I love it that he keeps trying he's messing with their heads the bookie yeah I'll bet 7,000 raised to 7,000 total well Rumit he doesn't bother messing with your heads he just messes with your money and why not why not the cards he has been getting oh incredible Morning. 7,000 to call. Yep. Haygood has called with the pocket fours. No choice, really. That's all he could do. No. Not a bad hand to have as your last all hand. 15 How much more to me? 
<laughs> Here we go. 7,000 total. Give it 706,300 to call. Oh, five, oh. six, eight, oh, I love it. He, he, he's such, a, he, he's yeah, such one, entertainment two, value. Three, he four, really five. is. Oh, he's a great five, guy. Yeah, he's proving he can count. But that is all he is going to do with that money. He might as well have been counting on his fingers and toes because yep. it ain't going in the middle. Unless he's had a serious rush of blood to the head. He just wants more air time, that's all he wants. Yeah. Yeah. Pass. Hogging the camera. It's that acting career I've warned you about. Well, Parks, he's just had Pass. a wonderful Pass. stroke of luck and he ain't going to push it. I think the way Michael's luck has been, I think uh, you could probably see an ace or a jack hitting the flop. Because when it ain't going for you, it ain't going for you. Well, right now, he's marginally in front. Oh, I've seen this one before. Yeah, Roommate won't be disappointed to see those cards. No. Lucky last time before. It's not exactly yeah. going to hurt him, is it? Another 1,500. Well... An ace king would have been a lot worse, of course. Three, king, ten. Well, there's a straight draw now for Rumit. One more out with the queen. Yeah. Doesn't want to see another spade, though. Does Michael? Jack. Ah. There's there a jack, go. and suddenly, only a four can save our last remaining American, the giant six foot seven, Michael Haygood from Dallas, Texas. No. No. Cheers. It didn't happen. And it's back to the home of Texas Hold'em for Michael. He played very well. Wasn't perhaps as favoured with the card, certainly not after the first half hour as our English players. So home advantage looking to be crucial here. We're down to three. Welcome back to the party poker.com poker den where we've just witnessed the demise of the tall Texan Michael Haygood his pocket fours beaten by jacks he was ahead when we went into it pocket fours but when that jack hit on the turn I'm afraid it was goodbye cheerio and get yourself back to Texas courtesy of Rumit Samoya he's the man now with most of the money and a smile on his face, and why not, with 30,000 smackers stacked up in front of him. The button's on, Chris Parks, Rumit, the small blind. Anthony's going to be the big blind, so the action will come right back round to the button. Chris is going to be the dealer, and he's going to be under the gun. I think any semblance of a good hand from Chris now is going to go all in. He has to. Pass. Good enough. Pulse this one. Let me win this one, eh? Friend to friend. You don't have to bully it. I'm going to call. Call. Cool. That's music to Anthony's ears, actually. He was hoping that yeah. Rumit was thinking he was bluffing again, but... Uh, you could be hearing from me. He's actually got quite a good hand. You could be hearing from me. You will be hearing from me. I'm going all in. There you go. All in. How much is that? Your in, guys. It's a good move from Anthony because it's a it's a massive hand where there's only three of you. There's absolutely no way that Rumi can call this. I mean, it obviously, it's easier for us to to see their hands, and we can see who's got the best hand. But you know, if you're sat there with 10-5, you don't want to give Anthony the chance to double up. It's just too dangerous. It will be a ludicrous move to call. Okay, Anthony, I'll let you have this pop. Well, from your mouth to the ears of well, Rumit Samoya. Did you? Did you? No. Not with you two, anyway. <laughs> Nothing's easy with you two. Nothing is easy, says Rumit Samoya. Well, he's got £30,000. He doesn't have to work too hard to for it. There you can see the huge slice of pie he has. And little Parks, I'm afraid, is looking like Oliver Twist. He needs some more of that pie. 
Hardy, well, he's holding his own. And it is 